Today, I went over to the mall, and while I was there, I ran into a pretty interesting product. It is called Mega Gross Minis, and inside, they've got a bunch of products that are gross, of course. And while I was looking at them, I found out that one of them inside is actually a Funko Pop, but not just a normal one, a Funko Poop. As soon as I saw that, I knew I had to get some, so I grabbed five, and we're gonna see if we can pull it. And now, the interesting thing is with these, they're not actually made by Funko, they're made by Zuru, and if you guys wanna see on the side, there, that's one of the ones we could possibly get. There are also 35 other ones, and once we open up the first one, we'll be able to check out the checklist to see what we can exactly get. All right, everybody, the wrap is off, so let's crack it open and find out what exactly is inside of here. Okay, so it looks like we get a sticker. Dead Bull Energy Drink. Then it's got a bull skull, kind of weird. Then it looks like we also get some slime, and if I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I'm gonna be opening this up. We're just going for the toys today. But then I noticed here is the checklist, so we could take a look at it and yeah there is a lot of stuff in here it looks like there's a lot of pretty gross stuff inside and if you'll notice the funko poop that's the one we're going for and it looks like his name is turdy i hope we get it and so here we are everybody a garbage bag with our stuff inside and i believe there are three of them in here and you know what this one is looking maybe that shape. So let's start with this one here and find out what it's going to be. Oh, it's Tabasco sauce, but it says Gasco. That is definitely a weird one. So let's find out what we're gonna be getting in bag number two. Oh, you know what? Ah! Ah, this is the pizza, Papa Vomito's Pizza. Now, I know that there is a super rare version of this one. I'll have to check the list. I'm not sure if that is the one, but let me see if there's anything about it. Okay, no, so the burger is, and then if you get the glow version, that's the rare one. And it doesn't look like this one glows. I don't think so. Oh, I'm also just noticing now the box actually opens up and you can see inside it's got eyeballs on the pizza. Oof. And so, so far we don't have anything with Funko Pops, but that doesn't mean we can't get it on the third one here. Come on, what do we got? Wait, it's the McDonald's burger. Ooh, pretty rare. Well, actually, hold on. It says McMaggots, not McDonald's for copyright issues, I'm sure. And this one here is, let's see, find the super rare moldy minis. And I believe, yeah, that is the one. I'm also just noticing now it says that there are stinky versions of some of these too. Ugh. So not too shabby, but it's not the Funko Pop yet. So we definitely need to get into the second one here. And fingers crossed we do get one today. Alrighty, here we go. Ball number two. Can we please get a Funko Pop inside of here? And the sticker we got was, ooh, spewy sushi unfresh is best. Ugh. Then of course we've got the bag and let's find out what we've got here. And these are again feeling kind of thick. And so I guess we'll start with the thinnest one first to find out if we're going to be getting a double. Maybe it's the Tabasco sauce again, but I don't think so. It is, ooh, it's the Converse shoe, which is actually called Snotverse. Does it smell? Not that I can tell. Like, there might be a little bit of a stench to it, but definitely not a lot. And so now, everybody, bag number two. What do we got? This is, ooh, scumball soup. <laughs> and it looks like there's a bunch of scumballs coming out of the top. Oh, no, it says cream of pimple pus. Ugh. Yeah, that is definitely a gross one. And then we've got this bigger one here, which feels not like a pop box, but still something larger. Oh my gosh. Wait, this is the moldy one. Oh, it's actually flocked. I thought the burger in general was the rare one, but no, this is the rare version. You can see it's got a little bit of fuzz on top. Let me show you guys the other one so you can compare it. Yeah, that is definitely the moldy version. So you know what? Not too shabby. And I'm gonna have to put this one somewhere safe. Do they make a a maggot burger protector? I don't know. And I gotta say, so far with me opening up two balls and not getting any doubles, it's pretty decent. I honestly think the hardest part about these is opening them up. But anyways, we are getting into our third one now, and I really do hope that we get a Funko Pop today, because that would be amazing to see in person. And the sticker here, ooh, I believe it's supposed to be PS5, but it just says Pus. Ugh. I feel like honestly, that is the noise of the day. Ugh, cause most of these are just like kind of gross to hold even though they don't feel gross. And now let's see what we've got going on here with the three of them. And this one feels kind of squishy. So you know what, I think just for fun, let's start with the squishy one, which ends up being, oh, this one's neat. It's the Santa Cruz skateboard, but it says Santa 
Ooh, wow. Now this one I am really enjoying and I also feel like there was a rarer version of it too. Let me take a look here, okay? So there's a glow in the dark one that you could possibly get and it feels like it might be kind of glowy. I'm just not exactly sure. But either way, a fun thing to get inside of here. And now let's get into the next one here, which is actually really, really flat. So let's see what we got. Is it just kind of like maybe a thing of licorice or something? Oh, bunch of Poo loons. Oh, I don't know if you guys have ever seen bunch of balloons, but it's just full of poo. And so pretty neat that you can get spoofs on licensed things inside of here. And that's why I thought it was so cool that they threw in the Funko Pop one. And again, we still haven't got a double yet. Let me just find a spot to put the bunch of balloons and there's fine. And now I'm feeling this one and it kind of feels like possibly another shoe. I'm not exactly sure, but let's find out together, I guess. And this one, oh, is not a shoe. It is, oh, Goritos. Ew, it's like Doritos, but they're toes. And now something that I do have to say about these is that I really enjoy that most of them are plastic. Like they're not made of cardboard or anything cheap, but I think for 20 bucks a ball, it is definitely worth it if you like these. It's just, I don't know who enjoys Toe Cheese Supreme? Let me know in the comments. Okay, so, so far we have got nine different items. No doubles yet. And I really am hoping that because maybe I got them all from the same case, you never know, the Funko Pop could be in here because maybe they don't double up in the same case. Or maybe I've just been getting super lucky. Who really knows? Anyways, let me just get into this one and then we'll get back to it. Alrighty, here we go. And this one, I'm gonna be honest, feels a little bit heavier than the rest of the ones that I've done so far. And you never know, that could be a Funko Pop. This feels really big. And anyways, we got Stinks, which is, I believe, like, Lynx the Axe Body Spray. I'm pretty sure it's called Axe in North America, but then Lynx in, like, Europe and the rest of the world. But anyways, let's find out what we've got here. And I'm guessing, uh, let's do this one. Feels pretty big. Oh, you know what? It feels kind of like another pizza. So maybe we got like a different version of it. No, nah, nope. This just looks like Papa Vomitos. Oh, and you know what? Now that I think about it, I can check this one to see if one of them feels like it glows in the dark. You know what? I don't think so. Probably, probably not. So it looks like that's our first double of the day. And now let's get into the second one inside of here, which is... Oh my gosh, Sewers Rat Pie. And they even have, let me show you guys the backside here. So there's the rat pie, but on the backside, there's a hole with a bit of a rat sticking out of it. Oh, that's funny. On the back here, it says, from the drains of New York. <laughs> And then everybody, we've got one more for this. Then we'll open up the last ball after and let's find out what we've got. Ooh, a rot dog. They've got so much detail on this. You can see the nails and like maggots coming out of it. Also, I've noticed the maggots are kind of like rubbery. So they move around a little bit. Definitely weird. But again, not a double. So I will take that. And now please, can we get a flushy poop inside of here? Which I know everybody sounds super weird to want. But now that we're so far into it, I feel like I have to get it for my collection. So let's crack it here and see what the sticker is going to be. Ooh, we got Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> and now I wonder if the sticker correlates with what you're going to be getting inside because I did see that there is a Pokemon one that's possible and let's hope that we just get the pop one on this. Come on. It is, ooh, Webster Free Range Tarantula Eggs and there is a giant tarantula on the top with some ooze coming out of it. Definitely weird, but hey, that's another one for the collection. And now we've got this, which I'm going to be honest, feels different than anything else I've opened up. It is, oh, sick talk, sick talk. Yeah, sick talk. I'm gonna be honest, it took me a second to figure out what that was, but it is TikTok, but they're looking a little bit under the weather. And then everybody, we've got one more for today. And this one feels pretty boxy, so I'm not exactly sure. Um, ah, we got spewing sushi, unfresh is best. And well, everybody, it looks like we didn't get a flushy poop today, but if you guys want to see me open up more of these in the future, I totally can until we get that figure. Because I really do want to see what it looks like in person. And also, I'm noticing here, we've got most of the set done, so if I do another video, we might actually be able to finish this off. Oh, and I'm also noticing they've got like sick tacks, and then there's also some awful O's, like Oreos, ugh. And I would also like to get that Pokemon in the future. I think that could be really funny. But anyways, that is pretty much everything for today. And let me know in the comment section below if you've seen these before. But anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy and I'll see you tomorrow.